Hi guys, hopefully everyone is doing well today. I'm here with my thoughts and review on the Maybelline Lash Sensational Luscious Mascara. And I've been using this for over a month and I wanted to share with you my thoughts of this product. So this is what the packaging looks like. It's the Lash Sensational Luscious. I picked up the cover color uh, yeah, 701 Black is Black, and it says Dense Supple Lashes Volumizing Mascara. It has a fanning brush where it, when, um, over here, it's like longer, and then once it goes to the tip of the wand, the brushes get smaller. So, I got the washable. I don't really prefer the waterproof mascara, but it does come with this uh, <laughs> it does come in waterproof with this mascara is what I'm trying to say so it says that the reservoir brush envelops lashes with formula with pre precious oils from root to tip while fanning out lashes are left feeling soft and lush not brittle so that's the one thing that I really love. I don't really love mascaras that kind of leave the lashes heavy and crunchy. I don't really like that look. Um, I did not have any flaking whatsoever. It comes off really nicely and I use my Garnier Micellar Water. It comes off really nice with that. And yeah, so I guess I'm going to curl my lashes because I've been getting a little bit of ish people saying, why don't you curl your lashes? What about, you know, for people like me that have straight lashes, I want to see if it, you know, her holds the curl. This does hold the curl. It's just that the formula is so wet, it may kind of weigh your lashes down if you have those kind of lashes that kind of just stick out. So... Uh, you can I don't necessarily always curl my lashes because my lashes are curly uh, on a normal daily basis but for this video I'm going to curl and when I curl my lashes I honestly have to brush them out because my lashes are kind of on the thick side and they do their own thing if I don't curl them I mean what do you what, what am I trying to say they kind of get stuck together because I have a lot of hairs so I'll just brush them out and let me bring you in so we can get started okay so this is what the brush looks like same with what how I showed you on the can we get it together camera I don't know if it's in focus or not my glasses are off but anyways let's get started so like I said the formula is really wet but I feel like it just kinda grabs onto your lashes and for me, it gives me those lashes like it looks like I have fake lashes on. Make sure that you're done with your eye makeup. Like I said, don't try to go in. If you do, wait till the lashes are completely dry. So that's with one coat. Okay, so that's one coat. I'm gonna just wait a second and I'm gonna go to this other side. I'm listening to JLo over there crying like a dog. So that's one coat. I find the the tip of the 
want a mascara wand easier to kind of put product on the lashes and not get it anywhere and try not to poke yourself in the eye Marisa while you're doing this demo so that is one coat I don't know why this eye is like so red over here Almost. Almost? Mm hmm. Almost, mommy? Yeah. And don't be putting Bella in her crate. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, that's not funny. Yes, it is. Okay, so that's two coats. Seems like I can't talk when I do this. So that's it, you guys. That's So, I really like, <laughs> oh my god, this this video is a complete fail, but this is like the third time that I've filmed this. Jayla, leave that up there, please. That's for grandma. Um, I really like this mascara. Just let it dry before you do anything. I even let it dry before I put my glasses on because otherwise the formula gets, um, kind of goes transfers up on the top lid so that's the only thing is that it is really wet of a formula but if you can get past that and just kind of you know go about your makeup stuff and just leave that alone I think you'll be fine but I really enjoy this mascara I love the effect that it gives my lashes it just makes them looks really full and fanny and beautiful and I feel like my lashes do kind of look like this picture down here. So I really like that. And what happened to my nail polish? Oh, goodness. All right, guys. I'm done with this video. I hope you enjoyed this review slash demo. Let me know if I left anything out, if there's anything more you want to know about this mascara. But I think it speaks for itself. And... Yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this review, and that's it for today's video. I hope you guys have a wonderful day, and until my next video, y'all take care. Bye.